a $7.5 billion feat of engineering. One of the world's biggest construction projects, a project so marvelously planned that'll forever change an entire continent. A massive innuendo, a mega tunnel, all to be built on this quiet little island? Let's take a look, shall we? Sweden recently agreed to contribute to the construction of the Oresan Bridge, in exchange for Denmark looking at the possibility of building a fixed link at the Fimarn Belt since the Swedish government perceived a shortcut there. Thankfully, it wasn't as outrageous as you would have thought. Since the 19th century, there have been countless discussions about building a railway between Hamburg and Copenhagen, but nothing much has actually been done until the 1960s when a bridge was constructed to cross the narrow body of water known as Fimarn Sound that separates Fimarn from the German mainland. But don't hesitate to like and subscribe to our channel. The travel experience between Central Europe and Scandinavia is about to change thanks to a once-in-a-generation construction project. The $8 billion Fimarn Belt Tunnel will be the world's longest submerged tunnel and the longest combined road and rail tunnel when it is finished in 2029. The 11-mile-long tunnel between Germany and Denmark, officially known as the Fimarn Fixed Link, will be buried up to 130 feet deep in the Baltic Sea in a trench. It is a crucial element in the growth of the ScanMed Corridor, a transportation system that stretches over 3,000 miles from Malta in the south to Finland in the north. Let's first take a step back, shall we? A system of highways, railroads, and shipping channels known as the Trans-European Transport Network links every part of the continent. The ScanMed Corridor, the network's core vertical axis that stretches 5,000 kilometers from Malta in the Mediterranean to Finland's Arctic tundra, is one of the most crucial routes. See the bigger picture now? The said project travels through tunnels in alpine ranges and overseas. On the north-south route, however, a waterway known as the Fimarn Strait creates a 300-mile detour for both road and rail traffic. A frequently used ferry service will be replaced by a road link cutting travel time from Hamburg to Copenhagen by around one hour. The projected rail link will reduce travel time from Hamburg to Copenhagen from five hours to less than three hours. Wicked, right? The enormous undertaking is already well underway. The concept is incredibly exciting from an engineering standpoint. 89 conventional concrete pieces, each 712 feet long, will make up the tunnel. Each component will have one tube for service access, two tubes for the train, and two tubes for the highway. When finished, each component will be installed in a trench that is 39 feet deep. The 671 million cubic feet of soil, sand, and rock will be produced from the dredging that trench will be used to create new land and beaches close to the construction sites. To enable the start of the real construction on January 1, 2021, preparation work on the required harbor and tunnel factory started in 2020. Dredging was already 50% finished by mid-2022. But of course, like any mega project, there's a number of controversial standings too. There are those who oppose the Fimarn Belt Tunnel. Like many mega projects, its worth has been questioned frequently due to the exorbitant construction costs and environmental activists are worried about the effects the dredging work will have on the nearby marine habitat. Denmark is paying almost the entire $8 billion estimated cost, which will be reimbursed by high tolls after construction is complete. One of those exceptional works of municipal engineering is the Oresan Bridge, a massive building whose architecture and engineering work flawlessly together to form a truly iconic piece of infrastructure. It connects Denmark with the southern Swedish city of Malmö and was immortalized in the 2011 film The Bridge. Sweden had a huge vision at the time this crossing was being developed. The renowned Oresan Bridge that connects Sweden and Denmark 
is cited by project advocates as evidence that such an expenditure is worthwhile, despite widespread skepticism. Also, despite some vehement criticism of its expense during construction in the 1990s, it is generally considered to have had a long-term success. Actually, this project has a lot to offer Denmark. Cars are anticipated to cost roughly the same as ferries, 100 US dollars for a round trip, and are predicted to produce $4 billion in profit in the first 50 years of the tunnel's operation. An infrastructure improving tunnel that also generates billions of dollars in revenue? What issue could there possibly be? The construction has had to contend with more than simply the terrain of the Fimarn Belt, though. For the past 10 years, activists with the AGFF, an organization opposed to the Fimarn Belt fixed connection, have campaigned valiantly to halt the development of any kind of permanent crossing. Environmental activists are now focusing on monitoring the Fimarn Belt Tunnel's effects rather than trying to stop it now that the work is underway. The pure water conditions that are ideal for marine life in this region of the Baltic Sea will be disturbed by the dredging of the seabed to make the trench for the tunnel. Local activist Hendrik Curlin stated that the ecology of the Fimarn Belt is very diverse in an interview with B1M. There will be effects on all living things, including maritime flora and fauna, as a result of the clouding of the Fimarn Belt, which will inhibit the growth of macrophytes and plankton. Sedimentation is one of the environmental effects of the construction project that is most constantly monitored, according to Fimarn AS, the corporation in charge of it. This is a major drawback of extensive construction work. Any new massive project must be developed someplace, whether it be on the calm German vacation island, in the heart of a tranquil city, or in the middle of a pristine forest. Regardless of how you feel about it, it will have a significant influence. Agree to disagree? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more intriguing videos.